Good evening. I hope all is well. Hope all is well with you all. Just wanted to um, just come on here real quick and just share some thoughts that I've been having over the um, past couple of years. Thoughts that I've been having, reflecting on um, the past few years uh, during the time of the pandemic. I have really grown in the Lord and I thank him for it. Just growing in grace. Growing in grace. I just thank him for it. Because I'm I, not where I was during those three years. That that pandemic really shifted a lot of things. Shifted shifted a lot of things. It really exposed a lot of things, exposed the hearts of many, even in myself exposed a lot of things and really um, brought to light by the word of God and I thank him for I thank God for being with me throughout that time because that was a dark time for me but it was one of the best times in my life that pandemic was one of the best times in my life sorry about the, the lives that were lost due to COVID and things like that. But for me, spiritually, in Christ, that was the, one of the best times I've ever faced in my life. And I thank him for it because it, it, it really uh, was a time that I really was in commune with God. He revealed himself in a way that I can, I, I could never have imagined that I've never uh, experienced before. Revealing himself to me, who he was. Being in church year after year, growing up in church, hearing scripture, hearing different sermons. But we're really coming to realize I never knew him. But I thank him in that moment during that, that, that pandemic that he really, he really revealed himself to me. And I knew what it was to be born again. I knew what Peter said, um, what Christ meant when he said, Peter, upon this rock, I will build my church. I've heard so many sermons that just harp on Peter being the rock and not even explaining what the rock is. Oh, Peter was a rock. They hyping up. Uh, you think they need an uh, asthma uh, inhaler because they're revving up. Or that's what they call it, revving up. But not knowing what the rock, what he was, what Christ was referring to when he said the rock. Upon this rock, I will build my church. The rock. He said, you are the Christ, the son of the living God. He said, Simon Bar Jones, for flesh and blood has not told you this, but the Father revealed it to him. And he said, Upon this rock I will build my church, and the gates of hell will not prevail. The rock, what he was saying, is the foundation. The rock is the foundation. The foundation is you are the Christ, the Son of the living God. Knowing this truth, you have to know this truth. That's the foundation. When you have that foundation, you truly believe it. The gates of hell will not prevail against it. Because you stand firm on that foundation. Stand firm. In Jesus' name, stand firm on the rock. The foundation. Christ. You are the Christ. The son of the living God.